sense of inertia that I'm laying in bed, it's warm, it's comfortable, and it's cold and windy today, and I, I just don't want to get out. And in my mind, I'm thinking, I made a promise, and I have to be a man of my word, because... All I have in this world is my balls and my word, and I don't break them for no one. Do you understand? And so, I kind of think about this idea of complacency and just being in a comfortable place and not getting out of that inertia. So it's a series of small decisions you have to make in your mind. If you want something, you have to go for it. All of us want to be healthy. All of us want to be fit. We want to look good. We want to have that six pack abs. But few of us are actually willing to make the decisions necessary, the sacrifices, and to be committed to putting a plan into motion and going for it. Get past the inertia and push past that point of resistance. That's how you do things. Alright, so that was just a little bit of the stretch. You can see I'm a little short of breath. It means I've been a little lazy and not doing what I'm supposed to be doing. But I still feel good. I got a new job lead today. And that in itself is not really that interesting, but what is interesting is who called me for this job. It was the producer that I ran into this morning on my way to the hike. If I didn't get out exactly the time in which I got out, I wouldn't have seen him, and he wouldn't have remembered us, and he might not have called us today. It's like a Woody Allen movie where the timing is, is almost like scripted and how it works out. And I'm thinking to myself, God, I'm really tired. I only got five, five and a half hours of sleep last night. But at that moment I was thinking, what are you trying to do? Who are you fooling? Are you going to be a man of your word? Is it sacred, what you're saying? Can people believe you? Can people trust in you, what you're gonna say? And that to me, the fear of actually letting other people down or breaking my word is enough for me to push myself to get out of that bed and to kill that other person who wants to just stay there and be lazy and just sleep. And I know, no matter what happens today, if I fulfill that one promise to myself and to my wife to get myself out of bed, then I've done something right. No matter what else happens in the day, I've done something right to begin the day. That's all I got for you guys. See you next time, and I'll let you know if I got this job or not. Thanks for tuning in. I want you to channel this thing. I want you to, to have this internal dialogue with yourself. Next time you're staring at a, at a tough choice, an obstacle, a challenge that you don't want to get over, you got to push past the pain. You got to take one step at a time and each step leads to a success of other step and every step you take takes you closer to the goal. Don't worry about where you're going to go. Just start moving. Take steps every single time and it's going to lead you to where you want to be. Once you get past that breaking point, then the moment, momentum is going with you. I kind of look at it like you're in a rocket ship and it takes a tremendous amount of power and fuel to break the gravitational pull of the earth. But once you break free, you're in outer space and in zero gravity, there's no air, there's no resistance and you're floating and it's effortless. And that's what you want.